right, so let's take the stairs down. You embark upon the next leg of your adventure. You're on the final floor of our simple map. Your opponent waits here. Find him. Very well. If you defeat me, well, it is early to be talking about victories and losses. Let us see what you're made of. All right, well, you'll, you'll see what I'm made of. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be that hard. Anyway, Demon's Gorge. While crossing the ancient road bridges of Deadman's Gorge, you hear sounds of the moving be from below. It's an ambush. Draw one monster card. Three of dust. So there's gonna be fighting three enemies. Okay, there's one thing I really like about the game, is I love how the battle prepares. Like all your equipment starts to shower you. You can now count to Yeah, so the combat's not too hard. So, see the, see the spider sensor right there? When it's green, you can usually uh, block it. Just press Q. It's re oh, actually, I do recommend pressing Q. So also, um, also when you press space, it's just a, a basic roll, nothing special. It, the combat is honestly not that hard, really. If people say it's clunky, as far as I am concerned, it's okay. It's not hard at all. It doesn't feel clunky, but it's mostly because I've been fighting just human beings. You recover what you can from the dead. The dealer draws, draws you three game cards. I draw one equipment card. Healing cap. Also. Increasing the effect of one sort of magic. Buy food. Alright. Not very useful right now. For power, and it's simple. All right, so uh, nothing special. Let's look at the inventory you here. Always review your cards here. I think I, uh, yeah, okay, so I'm okay. All right, let's go to the next one. A winding tra trail. Fair, is it? No, it's not fair at all. Suddenly, a tree falls across your path, blocking the way ahead. The theater draws you one monster card. Two of dust. Give them all your gold, attack the carry banner for daring to threaten you. You shout about a cry and raise your weapon. The battle begins. At the very beginning, you're almost always going to uh, attack. In fact, you're probably always going to attack rather than do give you the other than do the other option. And like I said, the combat for right now is not hard. Okay, I just still really like that, even after playing all this time. Okay, so you attack. Attack. Oh, oops. Nope. So another thing, another thing I want to talk about is the uh, chain. Now is the um, the chain, the chain right there. Oh shit, I got hit. So the chain right there says one, two, three, four on the lower left. Um, I never understood why it's there. The only thing I could think of, there's some artifact later in the game that uh, gets powerful the more chains you get. You search the bodies for loot. The dealer draws you three green cards. Draw one equipment. Explorer's helm. Small eight to navigation. Reveals thirst. The encounter punch and grants you gold bonus for revealing every encounter at the level. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh. Oh, nah. Nah. You know, I'll keep by hitting him. Is that what you're going to do? Yeah, don't, don't question me. I know what I'm doing. 15 health. A little extra health. If it is only a momentary respite. Sure. Trinkling, traveling tinker. So this is what you mostly want gold for. In a shady grove of the beaten trail, you'll you find a traveling merchant looking to, to trade with wandering adventurers. All right, let's approach the shop. Let's see what they have. I might edit this out. We'll see how what they have. I do. Oh, I just wanted to really show it for this one time, just to show you guys. Wondering why you've been collecting all that gold. You now have your answer. We're starting to get into the meat of the game now. The back and forth between resources and rewards. So it's just a sword here, axe, shield. Okay, I actually like this one for. This is probably the best thing I, I usually usually buy. Usually, yeah, usually 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 buy. A classical approach to dealing. Yeah, it's one of my Artifacts favorites. Provide powerful 
Ryu's special ability to use in combat, but it takes time to ring him. All right. So whenever I'm in trouble, I usually press two, especially this is near the, yeah, this is actually the boss. So this is not a long uh, level. So it's yeah, Jack of the uh, first champion, a good man driven to madness by a war that took all from him, wife and child, kith and kin. From such dark and brittle iron, I forge my tools. Now we see your metal. All right, so I already read it, so I'm not going to reread it, especially since it's very long. So it's just Jack of Dust. So it's just the first champion this you're gonna fight. Unlock more cards if you can defeat this encounter. All right, let's go. Four of Dust. So it's gonna be four enemies I'm gonna fight, including the champ. Not including the champion. So the champion is its own thing. All right, so we're gonna see, we're gonna see in a second how the artifact thing is. Enemy attacks cannot be blocked or countered. Get out of the way or stop them with your own power. So the great so the spider senses you're gonna see it's gonna turn red. When it's red, you cannot press Q to counter them. All right, let me just show you the artifact. I like it there. It's just so useful when you're when you're in trouble. There's also a charge tab, so I have to be careful. Oh shit. Yeah, so. They can st when you're about to use your um, artifact, they can still hit you. So make sure you're able to hit it. Oh shit, no, no! Oh, that's what I'm trying to say. Oh, oh my god, I am pressing Q. Oh my god, that was horrible. I've never been that bad. I haven't been that bad. Down into the worms with you. Perhaps there is peace for him in the break. One champion has been sent to the cabinet, and yet we are only at the start of our road. You will face 11 more opponents who will test your strength, your memories, and your resolve. Few fall at the first hurdle, none reach the last. All right. We have wagered, and you have won. You may claim your rewards, yet I will also claim mine. Dang. As you improve, so arrogant. So do I. That's perfectly fine. I'm always ready for a challenge. So you get these special tokens. Usually when you do an event or after you be at a level, you usually get special tokens to help you improve your character. Or at least your chances of your character later in the game. So I got Jack of Skulls, uh, Death King's Hall, Local Peasant, Devil's Choice, River, and Captain of the Guard. All right, next token. All right, see so here, medium armor, chains of rage, mercenary contract, medium armor again, uh, fortitude's breath, and despite measures. Despite measures, sorry. Oh shoot, it's lagging. I'm so sorry, you guys. Very laggy. So I got banned attack, which is a new challenge. All right, you guys. So this is officially the end. This is what I'll be doing. I'll be playing like certain parts. And like I said, I'll edit this um, to where I'll make sure I'll edit it after after a car. So I'm not gonna edit it after a battle or anything like that. But once I am done with a certain section of the game, that would be like the end of the episode per se. So hopefully you like my first let's play part of a let's play. I'll be trying to I'll try to finish the series and I'll post as much as I can. Um, I really do hope you like it. If you like the material, like, give it, press the like button and subscribe. And you can always give me comments on how I can prove. Alright, see you guys.